Do you hate muddy balls? I hate muddy balls. I'm arriving to the green. I've got a birdie putt. I'm excited, but look. Muddy balls. No! Say it isn't so. But don't worry. In my pocket, you wouldn't even know it's there. Look how thin it is. Look at it. It's like credit card thin, not taking up loads of room in my pocket. I can mark my ball pick it up I'm on the green as the other player is putting I can literally pop it into my little cleaner give it a little clean and then I don't need to worry about muddy balls anymore I can hit my putts knowing the roll will be true and in get in there no more muddy balls for me under 10 quick well what well. I'm absolutely gobsmacked. I'm speechless. What the fuck? I mean, look, yeah, I get, I know it's an ad. It's ad for the golf line on shop. Now, I'm not sure if he's actually part of that business or they just use him to advertise stuff, but does he really need to do that? I mean, come on. I wouldn't, I wouldn't do it. A low, a low life YouTuber like me wouldn't, I wouldn't, I get people all the time. Can you review this? glove can you review this uh, one of those things what are those things you look through for the yardage well, i don't know what they're called i'm not a proper golfer but come on man like first of all right that's that that thing that was trying to flog you it looked like a right piece of crap didn't it just have a bit of cloth in your pocket or use a towel on your back <laughs> yeah and when he, if you look back at that video right he even you had a muddy ball he puts it in he sort of cleans it didn't he but he, he didn't even show you after did he because it probably didn't do anything. It should be smeared it. That stuff inside didn't even make any difference. Yeah, again, I know it's an ad, right? But come on, man. That's like cringe. That man will sell his ass for anything, will not he? And he's the guy that was dead against all this stuff on YouTube, wasn't he? What a hypocrite. Do you remember you took the mickey out of Rick Shields? He did a big thing on Twitter. Saying about Rick Shields and all these silly bollocks videos, right? And uh, Rick Shields, I must admit, it's a good, a good one from Rick. Because that's it, Mark Cross said, I'm going to do a, a, a video hitting golf balls with a big salmon. And then Rick Shields posts a picture of himself holding a big salmon up. Now, that was, it was a good sport for doing that, I must admit. But Rick Shields must be laughing his bollocks off. Why does he have to do that? I mean, the guy is doing all right. From, is it that? Is it because he's cashing out? Because what I mean by that is I used to, I'll, I'll watch a lot of tech tech videos. And um, there's one guy that I watch, I used to watch. His name was, or uh, well, the name of the channel was Unbox Therapy. And he's a really, he's got millions of subscribers. But of late, all he does is adverts for cameras and drones and stuff. You know, it's just uh, like a QVC. And a lot of people in his comments are saying about this. And I think what's happened, what happens is that they start to see their views dwindling and they think, well, now I can cash out. I can just haul myself out. And I think that's what Rick's, uh, Rick, uh, Mark's doing. He's, I think he's whoring himself out a bit now. And perhaps you might see Rick Shill start to do this because these views are not as good as they used to be. And so they start cashing out, and they say, well, we might as well get out. We're, gonna, we're not going to last that long. I don't know. Comment down below. I mean, did you think that was a bit of harmless fun? It did. It was a harmless video, but come on. That, does he need to do that shit? Come on, Mark. Sort your shit out, mate.